Supernatural Guru could save himself from a mysterious object flying toward him by stopping it, turning it around, and throw it away, without actually touching it using his telekinetic power. We have developed technologies to partially achieve this kind of telekinetic interaction. A user can control the movement of an oscillating pendulum using the hand movement and force. We use electromyography signals to interpret how the user moves and strains the hand to interact with a small ball hanging within a cubic frame via four strings serving as a 3D tangible display. The mechanism consists of two parts. Mikein synthesizer derives 3D motion and force data from the user's hand movement. Spy motion is a 3D tangible motion display based on Spider, a 3D input device with haptic feedback. Let us first describe Mikein synthesizer. Mikein synthesizer collects EMG signals via eight EMG electrodes attached on the user's forearm. Different parts of different muscles produce distinctive patterns of signals as the user moves and strains the hand. We have developed an algorithm to synthesize different sources of signals into a musculoskeletal model from which we could estimate torque, stiffness, or joint angle. As an example application of Mikein synthesizer, we have developed a virtual marimba system using the estimated 3D motion force data of the user's hands. Let us now describe the second part, spider motion. Spider motion is an extension of spider. The original spider, a 3D input and haptic feedback device, was developed by the research group led by Makoto Sato in late 90s. We have extended the spider into spider motion as a 3D tangible display. The position and the movement of the ball are now controlled by spider motion. In fact, spider motion can serve both as an input device and output device. Spider motion is able to record the trajectory of the movement of the ball made by a user. The recorded movement can then be redisplayed by spider motion. Spider motion is a programmable 3D tangible display. We can program the behavior of the ball as if it obeys the law of physics. We have demonstrated a telekinesthetic interaction environment based on Mikein synthesizer and spider motion. The use of EMG signals allows us to capture not only the motion but also the force involved in the body movement. Such myokinetic information has been underexplored in the area of HCI and we believe that it would be especially useful for interacting with a tangible display. We hope that these technologies are going to help develop a platform for important areas of HCI research that focuses on myokinetic skills such as media art, entertainment, education, and scientific simulation.